combined with Randy Orton's RKO's? What's not to love? He does hear voices in his head. Man, if you haven't heard his theme song, go listen to his current theme song, not the one that he first started out when he was generic Randy Orton and he had that wheelbarrow move that was kind of cool but not really. Or when he had a CM Punk's original song. Not the one about like, with uh, the one he has now before he quit. The Cult of Personality song, the other one's like, the one CM Punk used in that shitty ECW remake, whatever that they did in there. Anyways, I'm talking too much. Anyways, Star Wars, the RKO Awakens. Let's start this shit. Come on, you fucking shit. Oh, fuck you. No, pause, pause, pause. There we go. Full screen it. Start from the beginning. God damn it. And this is why I should edit this shit, but no. Okay, let's do this again. Take two. Shia LaBeouf. Who are you? And his name is John C. <laughs> do 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 do. Why should I buff in this if it's all about Randy Orton? I need to do one thing. What? Sigh. I've got nothing to fight for. <laughs> nothing will stand in our way. What? I will finish. Just throw a piece at Darth Vader? What you start? <laughs> I love that face that Randy Orton has. Slittering. Do it. Can you finish the sentence? No, you were just going to do it like that. Okay. Hey, what is that? Five Randy or Tim RKO trailers that will never stop being funny. Huh? I think I saw that one. I don't know, because it has a, a Velociraptor and he's giving him the RKO. Maybe not. But yeah, Randy Orton. These things will never stop being funny, man. It kind of sucks that he's no lo he's not on TV right now because he's injured. <laughs> mostly because of the simplest things. If you don't know why he's injured, he mostly like took out the garbage at his house and basically pulled his arm or something. Doing an everyday household item. And he gets injured and he's out for a couple months. The, the shit that happens to you when you're a wrestler. Or when Kevin Nash basically runs across the ring and falls down and breaks his quad. The day he comes back from an arm injury. Yup. That's what happened to Kevin Nash. Kevin Nash, when he came in with Scott Hall and Hollywood Hulk Hogan. In the, the failed version of NWO in the WWE. Somewhere along the line, Kevin Nash got his arm injured, goes out for a couple months, came back, all healthy and shit, the first match back. <laughs> oh god. It isn't a tag team match. Gets tagged in, runs across the ring, falls down on his ass because his quads just fall apart. How does one break their quads from running across the ring? All oh, the shit that wrestlers have to deal with. Anyways, take it easy, Hero Nation. Bye.